Yes, hello YouTube, this is your guy Davin the Geek, and today we're going to be going over the best method to prevent yourself from getting a virus over your your um, internet connection or you know the browser that you use or pretty much any program like LimeWire if you use that I don't use LimeWire but if you use LimeWire you can set it inside this Sandboxy and Sandboxy is a Sandbox program and it's free up to 30 days and well it's still free up to 30 days but they will like like stop you from using it for like five seconds to like advertise their advertisement like saying purchase sandboxy you know that's the only thing but you can still use it even after the um, 30 days is, are up but um, let's go over what it is okay here is the hard drive that is not protected with sandboxy and this person or the web browsers are going on the internet and uploading data and downloading data and it's going straight well it's downloading not uploading oh my bad and it's downloading data and it's going directly to your hard drive and the blue area the blue areas are the hard drive in your computer and they're going right to your hard drive viruses are going straight to your systems 32 folders all of that stuff and you do not want that but this this is right here is an illustration of someone who do not have sandboxy on their computer and down here is a is a computer is, that is using sandboxy and what sandboxy is doing is it is containing all the information I mean not, not all information all the data that's what, I'm, that's what I was trying to say all the data that's coming via the browsers or any other program you put inside the sandboxy and it is not touching your your um, hard disk at all and the yellow part right here portion is sandboxy you see it's in an empty area on your hard drive and it is not putting any software or programs into your disk your hard disk you know your critical files and systems nothing can touch your systems and you might be saying like okay what is this this is this isn't special or anything to me what am I gonna do with this well if you come up here and read it says it will prevent you from getting rogue software and viruses and malware malware pretty much all is malware but what this I mean what rogue software does is like you could be surfing the web and you click a link that you didn't know that was a virus there that's you know that's in that link and the virus will automatically upload itself into your systems files I mean you don't have to click download or nothing it will just automatically do it I mean that, those are the new or they're not new but they're the script viruses and people are and, you know people are starting to use them more and more often um, hackers that is and you do not want that I use um, sandboxy but I had uninstalled it because I'm going to show you how to download it today I will have this link sandboxy.com in the um, descriptions and I will have the link from download.com in the descriptions as well I mean it's a good program and everybody should be using it I mean if you're not using it get on it I mean it's a really good program but one thing is that it does not work with um, Windows 64 bit you know operating systems they they just they said that it, it was too unstable or something like that I don't know why but they never got around to making it so if you have systems 30 I mean if you have a um, 30 uh, 64 bit operating system you're out of luck this only works on 32 bit operating systems and yeah so let's just get to downloading it right here we're gonna click download sandboxy and we're going to come down here and we're gonna come right here where it says sandboxy and you click this and now it's starting to download you're gonna save for me I have um, speed download or accelerator whatever you call it I want it to save to my desktop Okay, it's downloading. Okay, it just downloaded. Let's close this window right here. 
here's the EXC right here. I'm just moving it over. And we're going to install it. Double click it. Just waiting real quick. Okay. If you, you pick your language, whatever language you have, this is English. So, yeah. I'm going to agree. Yes. And it's extracting it, you know, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Don't let it, just let it install. I mean, this is good program, Sandbox. You can put LimeWire in it. I mean, run LimeWire inside the Sandbox. It's complete right here. And you can make sure that all your songs aren't like viruses that are trying to turn into executables on you and trying to um, install something onto your computer. You do not want that. Believe me, I, I suggest more people do that um, with LimeWire, with this program. Again, I don't use LimeWire, never have don't need to let me just um, set this to hold on let me set my firewall right there I'm just coming over here to see okay sandbox I do believe it just installed where is it okay here we go We're going to use the web browser one. I'm bringing that out here. Okay, here it is. Now, this one, it will open up your default web browser, which is like, I have Firefox, so it should open Firefox. Let's open it. It doesn't usually take this long. It's just my computer. So here's the 30 day thing right here. I had Sandbox on here already and that's what this is what happens when it's already up your 30 days. But you just click this and then you can still use Sandbox, it doesn't matter. Let's just add those. Okay. Okay, here's your Sandbox right here. I have this set to Why are these updates? I got it set to Hold on. Hold on, it's installing some updates right here still. No, I already know about Sandboxy, so. Hold on, I'm just gonna. Turn my firewall off right now. 